Hello everybody, my name is Brandon. This is episode 9 of my Freedom Fighters playthrough. And the last last mission we took out the general of the Soviet Union Army, General Tatarin. And uh, and then what we found out was that Dr. Jones that has been helping us out was actually a double agent. Which, now that I think about it, doesn't really make much sense. Anyway. <laughs> Just because, you know, I didn't realize a general of an army, regardless of their double agent or not, would allow so many soldiers of his own army to be killed. Whatever. We don't need to go into the logistics of it, but... So, and that's who's talking to us now. General... General Bilbe. Man, whoa! So, um, so yeah, so now our objective is to escape from the sewers and meet up with the other freedom fighters that have hopefully escaped un unharmed. Um, as you might have, you know, in episode 8, I started out this level and then I got royally fucked. This is one of the harder missions in this game. Just cause you're I don't like the missions when you're by yourself. I need my teammates. I need to tell them what to do. I need to direct them around. But nevertheless, we will meet up with them soon. You know, I thought it in, uh, in episode 8, I thought I was doing alright and but uh You know I got I got up to that area and kind of fucked it up. Whoa Alright. Grab that health pack and use this rock as cover. I do not have time for this foolishness, Christopher. I have more important matters to attend to. But I want to get up. I want to get up in that area because. uh... Holy shit! I want to get up in that area because. uh... Whoa! Game froze for a second. I, I want to get up in that area because I'm pretty sure there's a rocket launcher up there, and that will. Uh, I'll be able to take out the guys on the other side quite easily if that's the case. Dude, how many shots do you take? All right, let's heal up real quick before we go upstairs. Grab that, grab that. <coughs> so if I have a rocket launcher, uh, those guys are toast over there. Let me take out this guy real quick. Sometimes he's a pain. So I've got a plan on how to Enough. make this a little bit easier. And it involves uh, Molotov cocktails. Just let them burn out. Oh. oh, I thought I got that guy. There we go. Oh, man. All right. I'll just... I, th I believe he's the only one left, so... Fuck. Oh, on my last bullet. Mm, I think I want to switch back. Well, holy crap, there's a lot of... <coughs> Alright, that's everything up here. So... Later, guys. Whoa.
I like the automatic rocket launcher. This is pretty sweet. I didn't know Soviets had this kind of technology. I don't know what he means. What is that? Death? Is that what he means? Huh. Nice. Oh, the ragdolls in this game are so awesome. Wunderbar, wunderbar. Oh, wow. I've got full health packs. Let's heal up. All right. Let's continue our escape out of this hellhole. No, I don't really. I think I'll. I think I'll stick to shotguns since. Uh, oh, is that correct? I think I'm gonna stick with the shoddy since you know close quarters type stuff. Oh man. Swimming around in sewer water, Chris. Quite disgusting. Get a hold of yourself. You're supposed to be the leader of the rebellion and you're swimming around in fucking sewer water. Uh, I forgot where to go. Oh, well that's just uh, stairs to nowhere. Well, maybe not. It's people, so this might... This looks correct. Well, <laughs> there's just people running in from everywhere. Let's throw a grenade. Oh my god. Where are your precious freedom fighters? Yeah, where are my fucking precious freedom fighters? Holy shit! I believe in this level, we also get introduced to a new type of enemy. I can't remember if that's correct though. Maybe, maybe not. We'll, s we'll see. I'm full on health. I've got plenty of, plenty of ammo. Caution, steep drop. I wonder what they're saying. I just want to keep healed up because I don't. I just, we've made it this far. I don't want to die. Somebody else shoot at me. If anybody speaks Russian, what is Smiergreason mean? Please let me know in the comments. Oh, fudge. Alright, I remember this area. I need to switch out for the AK because... There it is. I'm going to grab some ammo because this part is a large room. I actually believe this is kind of near the end. Do not make me... Have I Are you not angry already? Are you like I figured you'd be already pretty upset that I'm doing such a successful job of of me, just a fucking freedom fighter. A guy that lives in the sewer is overthrowing your army, you dick. Let's do this. Leroy Jenkins. Oh man. If anybody's doing a Freedom Fighters playthrough drinking game, there's drink for Leroy, Leroy Jenkins reference. Jesus, I can't believe that. All right.
Yeah, I'll throw a grenade up there, I guess. Oh shit! I will spare the life of your friends if you surrender now. Wow. Lay down your weapon and show yourself. Surely you don't wish any harm to come to them. Whoa. Yep, there he is. That's right. That's the super fucking enemy. They're ridiculous. See? Wow. Woo! Their their hit point must be like fucking a hundred times larger than the average uh, enemy in this game. But he does have this fucking awesome gun, so it's fun to run around with this for a little bit. Think twice about what you're saying there, buddy. Oh, yep, there's uh there's another one. I was trying to get him out real quick. Nice. Oh. One thing I like about the like the machine gun in this game is that it doesn't take 80 million years to reload, and I know it's I know it's not realistic, but I don't care because I don't play video games for realism. Lay down my arms in a civilized manner. Okay, says the guy that's invading America. Brilliant. Oh, here we go. Cool. Just keep up with All right, there we go. Got out of the sewers. Um, I think there's a there might be a cutscene after this, so let's keep it going real quick. Tatiana Kempinski at SAFN Studios in New York. The <coughs> Soviet armed forces have tonight declared a total victory over the underground rebellion. After numerous barbaric attacks by the rebels on Soviet bases in each borough of New York, the situation is finally under control. We continue to receive reports of minor incidents around the city, but it is clear that the rebels have been defeated. Tragically, our beloved Commander-in-Chief, General Tatarin, has paid the ultimate price in his relentless fight against the Freedom Phantom and his henchmen. He was assassinated earlier tonight in a dastardly rebel ambush. We go live now to Governor's Island, where the funeral ceremony is about to commence. Comrades! This is indeed a day of infamy. We are gathered here today to bid farewell to our great leader. We came to restore law and order, to secure peace and stability in this region, and save the American citizens from brutality and exploitation. And this is the brave general's reward? He shall not have died in vain. As second in command, I respectfully take his place, and I vow today to track down the cowardly scum who committed this outrage. I swear revenge today on the so-called Freedom Phantom Christopher Stone and puny 
army of remaining rebels for the brutal killing of our beloved leader, Tatarin. Stone, your days are numbered. You and your followers will be flushed out and destroyed like sewer rats. Long live the Soviet Union! Long live the revolution! Long live Soviet government of the United States! Alright, so that's gonna do it for episode 9. So 10 shit is gonna get crazy, alright? Uh, that's gonna do it for me, guys. My name is Brandon. Take care, enjoy yourselves. Take care of yourselves out there. And thank you for watching. Cheers.